hopefully they don't try to play me like they did last time and give me four items instead of five. Hello everyone, my name is Sandra and thank you so much for tuning in. All right, y'all, y'all already know. Your girl went ahead and got another mystery Ipsy bag. Hopefully they don't try to play me like they did last time and give me four items instead of five or try to like, you know, sneak in some samples. Hopefully we got a full set of five full size items in this bag. Before we get into that, let's just observe the bag first and foremost. I'm pretty sure they had this mystery bag for like Halloween. I think it is absolutely adorable. I love that it's big. So that means I can store a lot of stuff in here. The zipper is very cute. Look at that. It's like a little skull, a little skull zipper. I think that is so adorable. And it zips really nicely. Like it's not flimsy. Some of these Ipsy bags that I've been getting have been a little bit flimsy. Like some of them are already broken. This one seems pretty good quality. Let's go ahead and get into this bag. What we got in here? Is it heavy skincare or is it a lot of makeup or is it a good mix. The first thing I'm seeing in here is by Anastasia or Anastasia Beverly Hill. This is the Dewy Set Setting Spray. This packaging is absolutely adorable. I love the rose gold. Let's see. Ooh, it's got a little logo on there. I love that. Ooh. Okay, this is so cute. I am not really into the whole dewy kind of thing going on. I love a more matte look, but this setting spray is beautiful. Look at that. Doesn't that just look like champagne, just like New Year's Eve amazingness? And it's really cool because you can just switch it to the side and that's how you know it's like on and off. Let's go ahead and see how she spray. Okay, do she spray good? Wait, I had it off. Ooh, okay, she a fine miss. Let's see how she feels on. I mean, I already set my makeup, but you know, we gonna try it on. That actually smells really good. It has like a soft, sweet scent to it. But let's see, let's see how she spray on my face and if it's gonna make this look more dewy. That is a really nice mist. It doesn't feel like little water droplets just dropping on your face. It is actually a fine mist and it smells so good. Did it make me more dewy? I feel like it did. I feel like it did add more of a glow to this look. We start off with a banger, okay? We start off with a banger. The next item in here is by Para, not not Para, Pear Nova. And this is something. Pear Nova Lunar Lip Style Lightyear. I'm guessing this is a lip pencil or a lip filler. This is what she looks like. Very simple. Okay, nothing too crazy. Yeah, I'm guessing this is just like a lip liner. Let's see how she draws. Ooh, okay, that's actually pretty nice. This is what she looks like. I think that would actually look really, really beautiful with like a nice nudie kind of color. It's very nice, a cute little lip liner. All right, we still hitting. So far, very makeup heavy. The next item that I'm seeing in here is by Well People. It, they, they have Well spelled all weird. I'm guessing this is by Well People, which is a very interesting name to call your business. We're, we're the Well People, okay? The people of the Well. And this is a Revitalizing Dew Snow Mushroom Eye Gel Cream. Mm -mm. And this is what the box is looking like. And this is what she looks like on the inside. Very cute. It's very minimalistic. Yeah, it's just like an eye dream, dream, an eye cream. <laughs> Maybe it's a dream for your eyes. I don't know yet. It says, using your finger, gently dab around the eye area in an upward, outward motion. Use morning and night after cleansing to awaken tired eyes and plumping moisture. No, not and, with. With plumping moisture and revitalizing nourishment. Ooh, okay. So we got a little, little eye cream. Ooh, and it comes with a little applicator like this so you can feel like one of those instant the grand people. Now I'm just gonna put a little dabby dab. We're just gonna see what the texture feels like if it has any scent. It looks like a little like a little gel. Feels like a serum. Does not have a scent, which is awesome. Cause I mean, you don't really want a lot of like fragrance things by your eyes. It literally has no scent whatsoever, like nothing. And I mean, it went into the skin pretty well. It is a little bit like, I, I don't wanna say sticky or greasy. It, it leaves a little bit of a film, but it's not annoying. You know what I mean? Like if it was annoying, 
annoying, then I'd be like, I'm not putting that under my eyes. But it doesn't feel annoying. It, it went into skin okay. It's always nice to have a nice little eye cream, especially, you know, we're getting older, we're, we're maturing. So we want our eyes to look plump. Okay, look like we still got a little life in us. The next item that I'm pulling out is Meadow Rose Strobe Luminizing Rose Gold Primer. What company is this? This is by Seraphine Botanicals. And this is what she is looking like. The packaging is so cute. Love the packaging. This is just like a little primer. Very cute. I think this is so pretty and adorable. Ooh, she extra secure. Not only was she in a box, but she also got a little safety seal over her. So that way I know for a fact that the only thing that done been in my product is the machine that filled it. That's what I'm talking about. Tired looking skin instantly comes to life with its natural looking glow enhancing formula. Let's see what she working with. Again, you can be like the Instagram people. This one is more of a cream, very thin cream consistency. It has a nice fresh, flowery, like sweet flowery scent to it. So it smells really nice. I don't know what glow they're talking about. I don't know. I think my arm already looks like that. I will definitely give this a try in a future try on video and we'll see what she really working with. Okay, we'll see what she really working with. And the last thing that I'm pulling out is by Iconic London. And this is the Light and Glow Dual. Light and Glow Dual. I don't, what is this? This is a powder highlight. And this is what the packaging is looking like. I don't think I have anything by Iconic on London. Oh, <laughs> I mean, it, this feels a little cheap, but it looks nice, okay? It feels cheap, looks nice. See yourself, okay? You look beautiful. This is what it looks like. Let's see what she working with on the inside. Ooh, okay. So you get like two different highlights, one a little bit deeper than the other, and it comes with a little mirror at the top as well well. This is nice. Let's go ahead and see what they look like on the skin. Feels wonderful. That is what they look like. You can barely see one of them because it's just blending in with my skin. They're nice. Nothing to really write home about. They felt really good on my fingers. I will say that. Not creamy, powdery, but just like a nice fine powder. I don't know how to describe it. This was a very makeup heavy bag. There was like one item that was skincare. The rest was for your makeup routine. I like it. And y'all, that was everything in my mystery Ipsy. This one is a lot better than the last one, just because they didn't play in my face, okay? They did not play in my face and give me one less product than I was expecting, nor do I think that they snuck in any sample sizes or deluxe minis, okay? Everything seems to be full size. I'm very happy that I got a lot of makeup products. You know, I like a balance. You know, I like like some skincare, some makeup. If they do like one that's like makeup heavy and then the next one is very skincare heavy, I'm cool with that as well. They do have two more more mystery bags coming out and I want them. <laughs> I want all the mystery bags. Like just give me all of them. If you like this content, you already know what to do. Like, share, comment, and definitely subscribe so that you can become a Febe. And I will see y'all with the next one. Deuces.